Hey you guys, check this out. Time lapse, look at this. Whoosh. Man, this thing just comes plowing in. It looks like it just dumps a huge bucket, you know. Makes me wonder if ain't a big old weather ship up there pouring it down. But anyway, okay, so I'm uh, testing out the P1000 again. And, uh, oh, see that bird go across there? Um, it was a bird, I slowed it down. <laughs> but um, I'm not um, gonna be doing a lot of this. I just, I'm, you know, testing this camera out and uh, you know just seeing how much of the moon you can see uh, versus the the p900 so um this will probably be i don't know i don't you know i'm not gonna say the last of the moon stuff because uh different phases you catch different things you know and and i occasionally look at it but i just wanted to uh, uh just show a few things about this and also there's a message later on in this video um, to those um, professional or so-called professional photographers who like to belittle and try to make people feel stupid. <laughs> There's a message later on in the video for those guys. But um, look at that. It looks like a, a seam, uh, like that one star you see or asteroid where it looks like two pieces put together. That's what that reminded me of. Well, that's some... Uh, hey, man, it looks like a city right there. Well, I'll tell like you what. Right yeah, look at that. It's crazy. I keep thinking I got that one. Yeah, look at that, how crystal clear. Look at that. Golly. Yeah, it looks like a, a dang old city. I didn't know it looked like that. Yeah. Boy, that is clear it's right there. Right. Yeah, I went all the way around it. Yeah, what I want to catch is some of them things flying. People have caught things flying, you know, around the moon and yeah. that appear to be close up. But I don't know. I ain't seeing anything moving around, though. Yeah, that thing zooms in like crazy. Maybe there. That moon's up there pretty big tonight, though. I am working. I've been working on a video. Um, and uh, it's going to be, I mean, you know, 25 minutes, maybe 30. Um, I thought about doing it in two parts, but uh, I'd rather do the whole thing because it's, uh, I'm, I'm calling it... Um, I rest my case. <laughs> it's. I'm hoping you guys will watch all of it because it's one of the more important videos, I believe, um, and and I feel like I need to get this one out. And I and I think it's important. That, and it's absolute proof, 100% undeniable. And this way, if I get that bug thing again, I can just point them to this video right here. That uh, well, the one that I'm making. Um, I'm, I've spent many many hours on this thing. You know. I've been working on it for a couple of days, off and on, you know, back and forth. Um, so, I hope you guys will, you know, maybe even share this one. Um, see, uh, you know, what people think about it. Because it's really, really uh, interesting what the, you know, these things that fly, uh, you know, around. It's just weird. I don't know. But um, I haven't seen anybody else. Now, I've seen these things in other people's videos, but not like what, I'm, what I've caught here on and the thing too is is I haven't seen them since which is a little puzzling but of course the chemtrails have lightened up a whole lot I've been seeing a lot more of the puffy clouds uh, recently also one thing I wanted to mention because I did in the past mention about the monetization issue you know I said uh, the reason I'm pointing this out right now is because I, it, it, I don't begrudge anyone. I hope no one took it that way. I don't begrudge anyone that monetizes because I know there's channels that, that they depend on that to keep their channels going. And if that was the case for me, I would probably uh, do the same, you know. But fortunately, I don't have to monetize to keep my channel going or pay my bills or anything at this point. And I don't ever foresee um, that I'll be required to do that. And, uh, you know, I said I don't want Google's money and I mean it. I don't. All right, I'm aware that this is out of focus, okay? So I haven't figured out the focus wheel yet. I'm working on it. I mean, I don't spend a lot of time on the camera. You know, I spend more time editing than I do on the camera. But um, it's um, what has got my attention is what is above it there that lights up. Um, it's, just, it's just something I was questioning, you know? But uh, yeah, it's a, it's a work in progress for me. So yeah, if you experts out there, uh, you don't want to have to remind me or tell me, okay? I understand, I know what I'm...
The day I got the P1000 camera, I threw together a video, hastily threw it together, wasn't intended to be polished or anything, I just wanted to get something out because uh, I had mentioned in a prior video that I had ordered this camera. The people that subscribe, the people that subscribe to my channel, those are my friends, okay? This is a hobby, I'm an amateur, okay? I do this because it's interesting and I share it and a lot of people out there find it interesting as well. If you've come across my channel and you're some kind of professional photographer and, and, and my videos aren't up to snuff for you, don't watch my channel. I mean, it's really easy. Go watch somebody else that, that you feel is up to your standards. I mean, here's the thing. I only had a couple. Uh, mo you know, when somebody leaves uh, uh, friendly tips, I appreciate that. But when you come by here and criticize like you're some, you know, I don't claim to be a professional. I'm not trying to be a YouTube star. I don't want 100,000 subscribers. I can barely keep up with the comments on the ones I've got. I mean, it's, uh, this is just about a, you know, a, a, a group thing for me. It's not about being a YouTube star. So you take your criticism somewhere else. I mean, the problem is, is I accidentally read uh, and there was only one and I had to, uh, you know because they, they've all been friendly and and so I just go through and I'm reading and then of course I usually like if it's the first two or three sentences if I see it's negative boom I mute it right away and I haven't gotten any in a long time but that video that I shot um, you know the day I got the camera um, it was uh, thrown together. I just got the camera. I threw that video together. I wasn't trying to make no polished video. And, you know, of course, somebody um, had to be a stinker and say something that uh, that I happened to read. And, and, uh, and, and, you know, it's just like, that's so unnecessary. Why do people got to be like that, you know? But anyway, that's it, you know. If my stuff is... Uh, not um, up to your standards don't watch my channel it's really simple there's nothing hard or complicated about it you know in fact I would prefer you didn't okay especially if you're gonna you know come on the comment and leave something that's uh, you know who are these people what are they jealous I don't understand why people want to be this you know do like that but anyway uh, enough of that let's get on with this here okay so I do shoot with the tripod, by the way, but the the wind is, uh, you know, when you're zoomed in all the way and the wind is blowing, you, there's no way of keeping that thing still. But I am getting an app. I haven't gotten it. I'm, you know, I can't do everything at once. I'm, it's a hobby. I mean, it's as I go. So I'm gonna find an app to hook up to my program so I can stabilize these things. Is that a dust storm or what is that? I don't think the camera's picking it up, but it looks like it's not rain. I mean, look at it, dingy. You can't even see the trees. It's not fog. I guess it's dust. Wow. Look at them. Look how bad that wind's blowing. Look there. I mean, it is just came out of nowhere. Anyway, we will time lapse on here see what happens whatever is a big old ship up there maybe that's one right there hiding in there yeah um this uh i guess was a dust storm that was um in front of uh, i don't know uh, you'll see the time lapse that's at the end and the one that was at the beginning that's what followed this <laughs> but it was like it was what was it was like it came on like i mean it was like the sun was shining, everything was fine, and I'm laying here watching the television, and I just hear the wind blowing outside like crazy, just out of nowhere. It was really eerie. It's like, whoa, where did that come from? And I thought, boy, a storm couldn't have moved in that fast. And I went out and looked, and that's what I seen was that dust everywhere. So I rarely see that, but uh, I ain't seen that in you know a few decades. Okay, we'll end it off here with a few uh these cloud images look at here that's got horns on it there little devil looking thing he got his little hand sticking out his left hand there yeah nasty looking little feller and then over here you got this uh 
this woman up there, the old woman, she's right there in the middle, and then that little crocodile thing to her right. Yeah, she's looking at her nose and stuff. That's pretty clear. That. Look at there. There's one of them worms sticking up out of the ground. <laughs> All the tremors. There you go. And then the little guy's getting smacked. There he is. Look there. Ooh, man. What a dump. All right. Thank you guys so much for watching. Y'all take care.